The boys of fall are back once again, and only one Friday remains between now and the start of the Bemidji High football season. Coming off a 6-4 and four season last year and a loss in the Section 8-5A semifinal, the Lumberjacks have hit the ground running. Well, I think the expectations for us as a coaching staff is that we're getting better, um, that we had a, a quality offseason, which I think the kids did, and now we take that, apply it to the uh, field and play with some uh, intensity and some physicality. Bemidji will need to fill vacancies in two key positions. Quarterback for the third straight year. We've had three kids battling for it, four actually, and, and now we're, we're really down to the two seniors and, and they're working hard right now. Jonah's got the upper hand um, on Chris, but tomorrow it could be Chris. And running back. And we have a, a senior running back now, Ethan Bush and Noah Hunt, who will be probably sharing some carries and games, and they're looking real good, real fast, athletic, so they'll be able to fill some of the hole. Both of them combined might be a Logan Hatfield. Filling the shoes of Logan Hatfield, the Minnesota Mr. Football finalist won't be easy. We adjust our system offensively to the strengths that we have each year. The years before Logan, there were some things that we were doing differently. We will also do some things differently this year based on our talent and what we've got. We'll be different, but we'll be hopefully effective. But no matter who gets the ball, the Jacks offensive line is up for the challenge. We have a lot of juniors that play at O-line and they're filling in nicely. Our offensive line, I think, will prove to be one that's going to be pretty good. There's a lot of depth there and there's uh, a lot of kids battling for those starting spots. Because the team has their sights set high. A section championship, that's the goal. That's what we want. We want to get back to what Bemidji's all about, winning. The only thing that can hold this team back is each other. I feel like we have a solid group, so it should be a good season for us as long as everybody can buy in. We're just going to uh, continue to do what Bemidji football does, and, and that's hopefully uh, have success on the playing field on Friday nights. Uh, play with intensity, play with passion, and be physical. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.